one of the most exciting times in the life of our church is our parent-child dedication. As we commit these precious young lives to the Lord this morning, Lucas Philip Belcher, son of Angie and Todd Belcher, Molly McGee and William Rents Ferguson, daughter and son of Molly and Kip Ferguson, Nicholas Scott Garner, son of Donna and Bobby Garner, Caitlin Reese Gingrich, daughter of Amy and Chris Gingrich, Watson Dallas Grantham, son of Mandy and David Grantham, Bruno Jesus Hernandez, son of Angela Morell, Kate Elizabeth Mears, daughter of Kristen and Casey Mears, Reagan Sloan Mentor, daughter of Catherine and Gary Mentor, and Alex David Molman, son of Millicent and David Molman, Joseph Raymond Nolan, son of Carol and Sean Nolan, Benjamin Lee Ratliff, son of Amy and David Ratliff, and Peyton Catherine Walsh, daughter of Erica and Jamie Walsh. This is always a very significant time in the life of our church. We do this several times a year now, which is a wonderful problem to have and a wonderful challenge that we have. These parents are here to make a commitment of their children, but most of all of themselves. So to the parents, do you now commit your child to God? As parents, do you promise to bring up your child in the nurture and admonition of the Lord? Do you promise to the best of your ability, best of your ability, to provide a Christian home, teaching your child the Bible both by precept and example, and praying for the day when this precious gift from God will trust Jesus as Savior and Lord and come into the fellowship and service of the church? And I guess the most important commitment next to the commitment of these parents would be to the congregation. As these children are brought up in the life of our church, we don't just sit back and say to the parents, lots of luck. We're involved in the process, every one of us, through prayer, through our stewardship, through providing activities and programs so they'll have the best chance to know God and to fulfill his purpose that he's given to each and every one of these lives. So this is a commitment I ask from the congregation. Listen carefully. Do you, the gathered congregation, join me in recognizing that the Christian nurture of children is a privilege of both the home and the church? And do you promise to pray for these parents and provide an atmosphere in which these children may grow to Christian maturity? Let's pray for them right now. Father, we lift up each and every one of these parents. May these children be brought up in a home where mom and dad love each other exclusively and beautifully and day by day. And Lord, also, may they be brought up in a home where mom and dad are faithful to your church. And they're faithful with everything they're about. And they give the highest priority to being in Bible study and worship, knowing that is a living example for these children to emulate. Keep your hand on these, we pray, this prayer of thanksgiving and commitment. In Jesus' name, amen. And we say congratulations to all of you. <laughs> 